Hello everyone, today I'm going to do an unboxing of an HP Envy 17.3 inch 4K display. Let's go ahead and get this done and then I'll run down the specs and everything. I used to have an HP Envy. I busted up the screen and they sent me a replacement. This one cost a thousand dollars more than mine. I'm just let me open this. I think I'm going to pause this and after I get all this cut open, I'll do the original box and then get it for going. Thank you. Hold on one second. Okay, I'm back. This is the box. It's Envy. You got the the design on the back. Mine, Um, I'm sure it should tell the specs and everything. I got mine from Best Buy. Um... Here's the the model number if you need it. It's 17 slash BW011NR. This one is has a fingerprint scanner or a sensor, whatever fingerprint scanner. Windows Hello. Let me grab this. Excuse me, I'm not prepared. I was expecting it, but it just came. And I thought, well, my well do put it on YouTube. And I'll be sure to do a, a fair, a fair good long video. So if you want to know what it looks like, everything more detailed about what it looks like, I'm going to do that because I try to look videos on there and nothing was fairly as what I was looking for. So I got this, open this up. Just like every other laptop, they had this box. I've seen where people said that they shipped the, the laptop just like this with no outing box like that. And I had mine shipped from FedEx. There's that. There's a little start guide telling you how to charge it. It's a 17.3 inch 4K display. It has Navita GeForce. Um, I think it's... I'm trying to remember... I think it's an X150 graphics or something like that. There's the laptop. It's it's a good size laptop. You think about a 15 inch. It's about a right about right there. About right about right there. You got like a good a good size laptop right here. There you got this design. Um like that looks like that it has a DVD writer right here you have your fingerprint sensor right there you have a USB I think that's a 2.0 I'm not sure I'm not good with it knowing what USB is what there's the power where the AC adapter goes where you plug in and charge it you got your your Ethernet cord you got uh, that's another you got two USBs you got an HDMI you got a a, a type C you got your headphone jack and then the little lock whatever you call it I'm not sure and then you got your SD card holder right there just like every other laptop power supplies right here get your charger Now, that's one thing different about this laptop and then what other people had. This one right here, they had like um, like the square one, the square little um, adapter. This one is one whole cord, I believe. And this one, let me... Because this laptop is almost, I think it's on $1,799, I believe. But... Um, they have it for four hundred dollars off. I think it's um four hundred dollars off. Is I think it, oh, I can't even remember. But yeah, there's that. Well, no, it's not separate. That's one thing. It's not separate. So you get two cords. You get your. You got the box. Like I don't need that. I just care about the laptop. That's what we care about is the laptop. <laughs> okay. As before, as I seen, you get this this plastic stuff right here. Uh, 
Okay. Tear that out. This laptop, it's it's heavy. But it's not heavy, heavy, I would say. It's um it's a fair size. You can see it's fair size and then height is pretty high. It's like um about my my hand from the size of my hand to my my elbow basically. Yeah, I don't know if you could really tell. It's about the size of my elbow. Um open it up. Now it's a fairly heavy laptop. You get the thing inside. There you go, you got your Navita GeForce. It's um whatever you call it, discrete graphics. It's got the Intel Core i7 8th Gen processor. Whoa. Okay. It's very premium. You could tell it's very premium. You can see that it's shiny. Like with the like just with me moving the light, you can see it actually. Um there you go, you can see it shining. Got your speakers up here. Bang Bang and Ophelsen, Ophelsen, Ophelsen. Lord, everybody I see on YouTube has has a hard time pronouncing that. Whenever I'm not trying to pronounce it, I can pronounce it correctly. So, this is what you get. It's a good size laptop. You would stand out. Turn it on. Let me let me put this laptop over here where my desktop is. So. Um, Get this looking a little bit better. Okay. There we go. Got my desktop right there. Set that USB right there. Let me bring this up. I'm uh got this going. Let me get this charger real quick. Pay no attention to me. Sorry, I'm trying to juggle cords and get chairs so I can sit my behind down. Okay. This laptop is nice. It's it's got a solid state drive. Hi there, I'm Cortana, and I'm here to help. Yes, Cortana. A little sign in here, a touch of Wi-Fi there, and we'll have your PC ready for all you plan to do. And I'm about to see Use if this your is... voice or the keyboard along the way. And if you'd like me to stay quiet, just select the little microphone icon towards the bottom of your screen. Yeah, yeah, no problemo. If you need an assistive screen reader, no, I press don't. the Windows, Control, and Enter keys at the same time to turn on narrator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, enough intro. Let's, let's dig, in. dig in. Yes, let's dig in so we can get to work and get this computer going. Your region is set to the United States. Yes. And then it has backlit keyboard, as Your you can see. Your keyboard is set to U.S. Yes. Do you also type with another keyboard layout? No. Now let's get you connected to a network. Do that. Now type your credentials. I don't I I seen people complaining about the the keyboard. I don't see nothing wrong with it. You know you could have cheaper cheaper build quality. These it's 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 very good. It's not it doesn't feel cheap to me. I don't think they would give you some cheap, cheap product stuff, like cheap plastic stuff when you're buying a thousand dollar laptop. Like I was going to think about Now type your credentials. Type my credentials? I already did, Cortana. Do you want the vowel? Yeah, that's fine. Oh. Mission accomplished. You're all linked up. Mission accomplished. You're all linked up. Yeah. Now we have some important setup to do. Okay, I'm going to come back just in a minute, and then I'm going to finish the rest of this. When everything's set up, I'll, I'm will i going to get the window set up, and then... Sit whenever, back and relax while we work our magic. After all this is done, I'll get back. Thank you, and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I thought I would include something while... That's updating. I heard a lot of people talk about the hinge, how they didn't like it. I don't see any really no big problem with the hinge. We're still working. You got a nice size laptop. Got that. 
And then let me see if this is a touch screen. I don't believe it is. Please don't turn off your device. I don't believe it is. I think I got the just the regular 4K display version. I'm going to let your this continue. Will restart before you continue. I know that. I will continue this after it's done. Okay, I'm back everyone. Windows is done. I'm going to start taking some of this stuff off. This laptop is not touch screen. As you can see, it's not touch screen. It's just a 4K display. Um, use small taskbar. Okay, I'm back. Sorry for that. Trying to see if there's any updates. This laptop has a solid state drive. Let me see if there's any more updates. I'm pretty sure there is. Yep, got all these updates. Windows, malicious, malicious, whatever, I can't even speak. Malicious software removal tool time 64. You got 2018 slash 9 security update. You got accumulated update, Windows 10. Yeah, I like that version. Windows 10 version. There's a lot of version updates. There's two of them. Now, I'm going to go do this real quick. Fucking stupid cats, excuse me. Okay, your PC is not fully protected. I don't care. I'll download that in a minute. Make that small, small icons. Okay, you have Intel graphics settings, and then you have NVIDIA control panel. I'm going to go to that. I'm going to see if it's different than the one I currently have on my desktop. I'm pretty sure there's version G. He has a GeForce MX150. Um... Help. I'm gonna see if there's any desktop edit file. I don't think I can. There's nothing, nothing really good about it, if you ask me. Nothing really good about these settings. Yeah, yeah, it's about the same thing as mine. The um, the other one. I'm a. Uh, Get this set up. I'm gonna go to where where this exact laptop is. Hold on one second. Um, HP.com. Um, let me search NV HP NV. BW, I think it's BW. I don't think it'll do like that. HP NV. Do this. And take this. There's probably updates over here on the HP um, support assistant. Um, laptops, 9,305 laptops. Um, HP NV 17.3. Let me see if that helps. 17 point 17.3. But yes, this is what it looks like. Everything about it. Right here. Your fingerprint sensor. Your your CD, CD reader pops out. There you go. Okay, let me see if I can find it. I think it'll be easier just to use the arrow key has number number pad. Would be better if I signed into my lab my my Gmail or let me do this real quick. Let 
Um, I think it's sign in. I'm a I'm a sign in real quick, and then that would be easier. Account account. Okay, there we go. Sign in right here. Sign in. Let me. Uh, I ain't worried about it. At Gmail. Not C O M. Let me see here. Let me re enter. I think I entered it wrong. Okay, there we go. It's going in. Okay. And then this one right here is the one I got right here. It's loading. Waiting for a response. Oh my God. Like I don't get enough of that on Google Chrome. Like for real. What the hell? Hmm. Can't reach this page. Why the hell can't you reach this page? Oh, some stupid stuff, my lord. Looks like um they having problems with their little Microsoft Edge windows are. Now I'm gonna click on it this time. There we go. This is what this laptop right here cost. 17.3 diagonal 4K display. That's what I got. I got 16 gigabytes memory. A 512 gigabyte solid state drive, Nvidia GeForce MX 154 gig G DDR5 dedicated, eighth generation Intel Core i7, Windows Home 64. I'm gonna go down all these specs for you. You got Windows Home, the processor, Intel Core i7. Graphics, discrete Nvidia GeForce and Max 150, 4 gigabytes DDR5. Display, memory, storage, 512 gigabytes, 512 gigabytes PCIe, NVMe M.2 solid state drive, DVD writer, integrated, 10, 100,000 GPE lane, wireless technology. Power supply, battery, battery life up to 10 hours, 45 minutes, video playback, external ports, one HDMI, 2.0, one headphone microphone combo, one RJ45, one USB 3.1 type C, Gen 1, data transfer up to 5 gigabytes, SDP 1, 2H, HP sleep and charge, 3.1 US, USB 3.1 Gen 1 HP sleep and charge. Um, warranty that's the weight the dimension 16.8 times 10.94 times well 16.38 inches times i don't know i'm not good with measurements i'm not good pointing device color natural silver webcam and this is what what it looks like same as mine Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to close this. I'm going to change this wallpaper. I know that for a fact. Um, I'm going to go to... I think I used to have one that I used to like. Let me go to Google real quick. I'm just, um, like I'm saying, I'm going a, I'm to a move this around. I got my... Let me do this. Okay, now got this. See? What I notice is whenever you close the hinge, the laptop moves forward, as you can see a little bit. Maybe, maybe, no, nah, not really. It's a big laptop, you got that. I got it in a charger, you got the back right over here. You got the new HP logo. Let me do this real quick, sorry. And then whenever you bend it, it goes up like that. 
Let me see if it can, um, couldn't recognize. Okay, there's, it worked. The fingerprint sensor worked. Okay, and that's, that's sad, I guess. I guess that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked the video. I hope this, this video helped you what you think about or what you want to visualize about this laptop. I hope it helps. Thank you for watching.